iPhone 8 release date, when does it come out? Rumors about an exact iPhone 8 release date are light but Apple is fairly predictable. That's why we can take a ruddy good guess at when the iPhone 8 will launch. First off, here's a recap of recent iPhone launches, iPhone 7, Wednesday, September 7th, reveal, Friday, September 16th, release, iPhone SIXS, Wednesday, September 9th, reveal, Saturday, September 19th, release, iPhone 6, Tuesday, September 9th, reveal, Friday, September 19th, release, iPhone 5s, Tuesday, September 10th, reveal, Friday, September 20th, release, iPhone 5, Wednesday, September 12th, reveal, Friday, September 21st, release, based on those dates, we'd expect the iPhone 8 reveal date to be either Tuesday, September 12th, or Wednesday, September 13th. And we think that the iPhone 8 release date will be either Friday, September 22nd, or Saturday, September 23rd. Of course, we'll probably see some accurate release date leaks emerging in the summer, as Apple begins making preparations for the event. iPhone 8 Design, What's New? The biggest change we're expecting to see from the iPhone 8 is a massive ramping up of the handset's screen-to-body ratio. That ratio describes how much of the phone's front is occupied by display, and having an all-screen front is the next big trend in smartphones. LG already debuted such a design for the LG G6, and the Samsung Galaxy S8 is almost certainly going to follow suit. The thinking is that you'll be able to fit a 5.5-inch screen, a la the iPhone 7 Plus, in the form factor of a 4.7-inch iPhone, a la the iPhone 7. This will almost certainly require the removal of the home button from the front of phone, to slim down the handset's bezel. There are some rumors that suggest we'll see a curved screen on the most premium iPhone 8 model, but there's no clear consensus among leakers and analysts that this'll be the case. In August 2016, a report from Bloomberg written by longtime Apple leaker Mark Gurman reads, Apple is already at work on a major redesign of the iPhone for 2017 that focuses more heavily on the display by removing the home button. Then in September 2016, the New York Times wrote, next year's iPhone will have a full-screen face with the virtual button built directly into the screen. According to prominent KGI securities analyst Ming-Chi Kuo, Apple will be using a glass body, like the one seen in the iPhone 4, and will build this around an aluminium or stainless steel frame. However, some sources, Mako Takara, DG Times, believe that only the biggest of the three rumored iPhone 8 variants will feature the new glass design. The handset is also tipped to retain the water-resistant design that we saw introduced with the iPhone 7. However, this may be increased to a more watertight IP68 rating, to fall in line with rivals like the Samsung Galaxy S7. Upping the ante on storage Apple may dump its current low storage option 3 2GB and start the base models with 6 4GB, according to Trend Force, plus jack up the amount of RAM to 3GB. This incremental bump would follow the recent precedent of Apple ditching its dreaded entry-level model, formerly 1 6GB, when it released the iPhone 7. And a number of sources have alleged that higher-end editions of the iPhone 8 and possibly a mid-cycle refresh of the iPhone 7 and 7 Plus possibly coming in March 2017 could accommodate up to 256 GB of photos, video, and apps. Cameras as a portal to augmented reality Apple CEO Tim Cook is talking a lot about dual-lens cameras these days. Probably because they can help a device place virtual things in your real-world view. Other phones in the Google sphere are already doing this albeit badly. A variety of analyst reports have predicted that the iPhone 8 will come equipped with 3D sensors that could enable augmented reality as well as facial or iris recognition. Veteran Apple analyst Ming-Chi Kuo has also voiced support for the 3D sensor theory, adding that Apple will equip with the iPhone 8 with a new front-facing camera system equipped with an infrared transmitter and receiver. USB-C replacing the lightning connector Apple ditched the 3.5mm headphone jack with the iPhone 7. Now, a report published by the Wall Street Journal suggests that the company will omit its lightning connector from the iPhone 8 in favor of the emerging port do JOUR, USB-C. Will the iPhone get wireless charging? Lots of sources on this one. 
Reuters reports that there are multiple groups at Apple working on technology for an iPhone that supports wireless charging. Earlier in February, Apple joined the Wireless Power Consortium a potential harbinger. Last year, The Verge reported that Apple has been staffing up on wireless charging experts, and the Nikkei Asian Review reported that Foxconn, one of Apple's main manufacturing partners, was making wireless charging modules for the 2017 iPhone. Unlock the iPhone with your eye, your face, or perhaps the sound of your fingerprint. A rumor from DG Times suggests that Apple has developed its own in-house fingerprint sensor, which will be included in the new iPhone 8. It's unclear if this is related to a previous report by Apple Insider about Apple's patent application for acoustic imaging system architecture. That technology could ostensibly identify and authenticate a user by the acoustic properties of their fingerprint, in essence, your iPhone could hear your fingerprint. The patent was filed on February 23, 2017. Previously, German site Handy Above like DG Times, and others have floated the theory that the iPhone May 8 have an embedded iris scanner that will let you unlock the phone by looking at it a nifty iteration of the current Touch ID feature. And a parallel rumor has it that the next iPhone will support facial recognition technology as an alternative, or perhaps supplement, to the current fingerprint scanner authentication system. Samsung's Galaxy Note 7 was among the first phones to come equipped with an iris scanner and it's worth stating that that particular feature had nothing to do with that phone's explosive reputation and subsequent retirement. It could cost $1,000 or more. Morgan Stanley analyst Katie Hubberty, via Macrummers, contends that Apple will deliver a dramatically redesigned iPhone 8 with tons of new features, supporting Fast Company's theory that the 10th anniversary edition will cost more than $1,000. It's certainly possible and, perhaps, likely, if the new model includes even just a few of the more dramatic rumored features. This would also pave the way for Apple to release less expensive models, i.e. the iPhone 7s and iPhone 7s Plus, in March. Check out all of the latest iPhone 8 rumors below. Specs we might see on the iPhone 8 Apple's next generation processor, perhaps the A10X or A11, glass and stainless steel body curved, edge-to-edge -edge OLED display a variety of possible sizes, including 5.8 inch, 5.5 inch, 5 inch and 4.7 inch models wireless charging USB-C connectivity, perhaps replacing Apple's lightning connector virtual home button, or perhaps no home button, enhanced water resistance dual lens camera enabled AR capabilities. Support for the Apple Pencil an alternative to Touch ID such as a face or iris scanner or acoustic fingerprint sensor. 3GB of RAM plus more storage, with a new 64GB base model and 256GB top tier model new colors, including red a heftier price tag, which could exceed $1,000.